on a day no to day. No way. proper rig you honestly feel like so cool driving it i'm not gonna lie if you guys remember last year about this time we surprised evan with a ford raptor that he absolutely hates because the problem was is that it's a ford and he likes chevys so pretty ignorant on our part i don't know what we were thinking since then we've been asking evan like what's your dream car what's your dream car and he always would say an el camino because it's a car but you can still put a dirt bike in the back so we're gonna try and make things right and we're gonna be surprising evan with this 1985 el camino today but first to really make it his style i think we got to donk it out i just feel bad like this thing is in mint condition. It has 66,000 miles, original paint. Check out the interior on this thing. It's all been redone. Whoever had this before took such good care of it. Like, he's gonna be able to throw his dirt bike in the back. This is a serious flex. Yeah, this really is the best of both worlds. It, it's like a car, it looks like a car, but you still got the capabilities of a truck. It's never really made a whole lot of sense to me, but I can see the appeal. Yeah, I'm not really sure why they made it. It's basically <laughs> just a lowered pickup, and you only have two seats. It's like the worst of both worlds. Worlds. Yeah, this thing ain't practical, but like that's the price of being cool. That's the price of looking <laughs> cool. That is the truth, dude. Yeah, so being you, cool isn't see? practical. Basically, if you guys don't know what a donk is, it's when you take a car and put way too big of wheels on it and then tiny little tires. Uh, but we're gonna be going with more of a moderate donk build on this El Camino. So we got some 24 inch wheels, all thanks to custom offsets, along with a lift and then uh, wrapping it at the end just to really put the touch on it. We got the lift on, now we're gonna throw the wheels on and see how they look. Wow. <laughs> it's so good. This thing kinda looks like a rig on Grand Theft Auto. Does it not? This is gonna look Holy so shit. good with a dirt bike. <laughs> this is like pickup height now. <laughs> you guys remember the show Pimp My Ride where they take like a perfectly good vehicle and then just slowly ruin it? <laughs> I mean like that's what we're doing. No, those vehicles weren't perfectly good, but this one was. Much better. All right, so we're gonna wrap it this candy red. I feel like there's no more suiting color to wrap a donked out El Camino than candy red. And it's gonna go really good with the gold wheels. So our buddies Kev and Luke are here. They're gonna help us throw this thing on and uh, have this thing looking right. I mean, Ev's Raptor is red, so I feel like he's gotta have the matching donk. So we're still not sure if he even likes the color red, but it, it's just gonna look proper. Dude, yes! It's so proper, it's so good. He's gonna love it. I think we might have outdone ourselves. As long as he doesn't off-road it, this thing's gonna live forever. But that is, I mean, he's definitely gonna off-road it. This thing's gonna have a dirt bike in the back, Mike. You can't keep that on road. All right, let's go hide this thing away and uh, wait for Evan to get here. We tightened everything up, right? Yeah, finger tight. Like this. <laughs> <laughs> How's it going on? Weekend? It's good. It's good. What the? Fuck is going on? Good. What? The? <laughs> All right, Evan, come on over here. We got a little surprise for you. Come here. All right, I need you to stand right here, and when I tell you to turn around, then you can turn around. Nothing's gonna hit you or anything. You're safe. I wouldn't do that to you. All right, so I know a year ago. We surprised you with your Ford Raptor, and that was pretty inconsiderate of us, being that you're a Chevy guy, and you, you, know, you don't have to say it. I know you hate it. So, anyways, we wanted to try and make things right. <laughs> Stay looking at me. Oh my God. So, we got to your dream car. No way! <laughs> Oh my god, 
dude. <laughs> this thing is unbelievable. <laughs> Dude, no way! <laughs> it's mint too. Dude, it is. What? Where'd you even find this? It didn't look like this when we got it. Oh. It, was much, it was much better looking. <laughs> <laughs> this yeah. was the most pristine El Camino we could find on Facebook. This is like the sickest thing in the entire yeah. world, dude. <laughs> We're trying to make things right, bro. What's it got for a motor? Oh my god, she's beautiful. Dude. I'm gonna feel like Kodak Black driving around in this thing, dude. <laughs> Dude, not what I was expecting to come around the corner. <laughs> I, I thought I heard an angry Chevy idling down the road. I didn't know what was pulling up, but it wasn't this. Is this actually an SS? Yeah. yeah. No shit? Yeah. <laughs> Dude, this thing is so sick. I figured you'd be stoked about it, but I didn't know that you would like genuinely love it. Dude, it is the ultimate car for a dirt biker. It, like, what other car could do this? It doesn't get better than this. Those are 24 inch wheels too. <laughs> Dude, they look so sick. <laughs> I just want to throw the bike in the back and go cruise. <laughs> so it's not even close to what I expected was going on. I thought maybe you guys were up to something, like a game or someone was gonna get hurt. Not severely hurt, but inconvenience, you know, like the mouse trap. <laughs> We don't have the best track record, so I could see where you would be uh, on edge. Yeah, this was a very pleasant surprise. <laughs> Look, walking this bitch like, hey. yeah, I'm really young. Really him. Don't believe me, come and see me. Got three wishes from my genie. Now I'm on your local TV. Y'all don't joke up. Give me she when they come and see me. When I'm in a local city, I'm like, pause though. Please step aside so they can see me. And I walk up in this light. Yeah, I'm really him. Talking my shit light. Don't really him, oh God. Walk up in this light. Yeah, I'm really him. Boys got me? That's yours. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no fucking way. Yeah. Oh my god. Do you I love it? just setting me a snap of like some ridiculous car. Like, ridiculous? It's El Camino. You got the bike in the back? Got the bike in the back. <laughs> not even my El Camino and I can't stop smiling. It makes me so happy just seeing this thing exist. Like this vehicle should not be in Cormorant. <laughs> and the fact that it is and Evan's behind the wheel <laughs> makes me so happy. Dude, nobody deserves it more, man. Dude, thank you, bro. <laughs> it's a beaut. Oh my God. All right, boys, we got some orb balls. Zorb. Oh, Zorb? Zorb? Zorb. Zorb. Z-O-R-B. All right. Zorb balls. So if you don't know what a Zorb ball is, it's basically a giant hamster ball that a human can fit in and run around in. It's kind of balled out on these ones, so it's like the double layer of protection. So they should be pretty safe, which is good because the boys have been getting pretty beat up around here. We need like added layers of protection. Safety used to come third, now it comes first around yeah. here. I don't even know if safety came third. <laughs> Well, this is about five times bigger than I anticipated. Yeah. How long until we pop this? I bet five minutes. I hope it's longer than that. These things weren't cheap. How much were these? They're like 1,200 a piece. <laughs> these were 12. Because they're building another donk for this price. <laughs> <laughs> so graceful. It's got a hole in it. Are you kidding me? That was actually under five minutes. I said five minutes. I should have went quicker. Oh. Yeah, that should last. Man, these things are delicate. I think we gotta load them up in the back of a truck just to bring them somewhere. They're not even safe on the ground. I didn't have the heart to tell Ev that it's not the most practical truck bed, but he's excited about the new rig, so we're gonna let him use it. This is ridiculous. Okay. <laughs> Do we need to strap it? No, I'm sure it's fine. You could just put someone in it to yeah. weigh it down. Yeah, Mike, you better crawl in there. Rock, paper, scissors, who rides in? Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. <laughs> <laughs> Man, this is a sight. 
I know what he lost is. Where did they come from? What? Where did they come from? Uh, just the sky, I don't know. <laughs> what kind of question is that? Where did they come from? That was funny. My gosh! How'd that feel? So fun. It's like a, it's just so fun. It's like a <laughs> miniature jungle gym that you just can't get hurt in. You're just flying everywhere. Get one ball on that side and one ball on this side and go at each other. Oh, oh my oh. gosh! Mike got freaking decked there. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Beat him up! <laughs> Dude, it's a freaking <laughs> flapjack, dude. I just got steamrolled. <laughs> the little indent in the sand. <laughs> oh, it's little because I'm short. When Evan's running at it is the funniest part. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think I've ever seen Evan run. He's got his little arms going. His little really stride. <laughs> he's giving her all he's got. <laughs> Like a fourth your size. It's a little bowling ball. Oh man, I love these Orby balls. <laughs> oh, oh, oh! <laughs> I feel like I'm at the circus right now and you guys are animals performing. That's literally most days around here. <laughs> what are you talking about? I kind of want to just drop off these rocks. It is a straighter line if we take the rocks. Oh! 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 This guy's such a showman. He really knows how to oversell a flip. Ah. <laughs> oh, oh. It's like the WWE. Oh. Mike, stop! Oh. I think these things are ready for the water. What are we doing? Do we just like hook a ski rope up to them? And drag them around? You want to drag it? Yeah. That sounds like a that bad idea. That sounds like a bad idea. <laughs> really? That what literally sounds safer than tubing. And people, like little kids tube. Bro, you're enclosed in a in a ball that could exactly. collapse at any second. Could collapse, but I guess Ryan and my head aren't going to hit, and that could happen tubing. Oh, two of them out there. Yeah. yeah. Gotta I figured have one. Yeah, let's do it. <laughs> okay. okay. Alright, I just want this to be said. I think this is a bad idea, so I brought a knife. In case things go sideways and we have to cut you guys out of there. That is worst case scenario, honestly. Like, absolute worst. Well, we're prepared for it if like we need that. it. Oh my god! They're telling you to go faster, CJ! Oh I don't know why. Is. Ryan is saying faster! He looks <laughs> mad. You better go faster! <laughs> now they said to make some big turns. I don't know what they're thinking. Oh my god. <laughs> Look at Ryan roll in that thing. Watching Mike's roll. Oh my god. Mike's so much. That worked Mike. way too good. Mike said he's done. Bro! <laughs> How you guys feeling? Actually the most fun tubing I've ever had in my life. It worked perfectly because they were just sliding like in place. You were just laying and everything was moving underneath you. That was the weirdest thing. It's like 10 out of 10 fun. <sighs> Sounds amazing. <laughs> he was driving like what, seven out of ten crazy? Five. Five. You, oh, okay. It felt crazier than it was. Yeah. This dude yeah, was telling me I to go like shit. faster, faster. I'm like, bro, I don't know what it feels like back there, bro. I'm not trying to <laughs> hurt him. <laughs> hey, who put that ball there? You just can't get bent out of a mini truck, even after spraining his neck last time. Come on, come on, come on. Go, go, go. Oh my God. <laughs> he legit sprained his neck. Oh! <laughs> 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 <laughs>
gosh. That, uh, that was intense. Yeah. That was <laughs> loud. That was really loud. <laughs> All right, guys, so I've got two separate announcements. The first announcement is we have a winner for the last giveaway that we ran. So anyone that purchased merch off of our merch drop got entered to win the CRF 110 and the KTM 125 or the option of cash. And uh, the winner is Adam Rosica. So we've already reached out to Adam, let him know that he had the option of the bikes or the cash and he chose the bikes. So these things are going off to Salem, New Jersey. So hopefully he's mobbing the streets in New Jersey with these things. He's riding a horse in a legalized wheelie shirt. <laughs> I love that. Now the second announcement is we're gonna be giving one of you guys the CF Moto Papio completely free. All you gotta do is just follow the Seaboys TV account on Instagram and then go to who Seaboys is following and then follow all the boys in our podcast from there. Screenshot it, DM the Seaboys account proof and that's all you got to do to get entered we'll announce the winner on instagram in about a week so yeah that's all you got to do thank you guys for watching and we'll see you guys next week